Hi guys, RB26 Delirious here, and today we have the BMW M3. So yeah, um, we've obviously got the E92 version, and for a start, I would say go for any one of these body kits. Because these actually make it look really good. All of them make it, obviously this car look really good, but we're going to go for obviously um, Liberty Walk. Uh, we'll put that bonnet on it because that just looks more aggressive at the front. We'll adjust all the stance saddle for you guys. Um, but yeah, obviously I thought I'd go for a BMW build today because I haven't done any BMWs at all um, so far. So I thought, well, might as well start off t you know, today with obviously um, a BMW. Um, I'm actually liking how this one's looking. Need to readjust some alloys uh, with the wheel. Sorry. Hmm. Okay. So. Ah. Okay. We can only put Need for Speed ones on this. So okay, that's fair enough. Um. We'll put like a little one on there. Need for the exhaust system. Uh. Do you know what? I actually quite like the twin. Exhaust system. That one there. A little bit bigger than stock, but not too big, so it doesn't overpower for obviously what I want for the car. <coughs> so, yeah, pretty much that's how it's looking so far. Okay, what well, can we do that? Oh, oh okay. Um. I'm going to put that on. Then see what it does. Oh, okay. It doesn't really do much. Okay. Um, we'll go for Liberty Walk. There we go. Actually. Let's have a look see what that looks like on it. So that would be a good spoiler to have if you're trying to make like a track car of this. Because it looks... It's not too big like obviously the Neva Speed ones, so... Okay, it's just restricted. Uh, screw it. We'll just put like a quick number on this one. Why not? Uh, we'll just put M3. Why not? Okay, so um, let's go for the alloys now. Oh. Ooh. Ah. Okay. Okay. Um. What should we go for? Um. It's a shame that you can't put the manufacturer alloys bigger than what they are, because if not, I would have kept them. But, I could definitely work with these. These look really nice. These look like what you would see on, like, the um, racing cars of the BMWs. You would see, like, this type of alloy style. So, that's perfect, actually. So, we're sort of going for, like, a mix sort of, like, track racer sort of um show car look to this car really um so that works out pretty good and uh, i'm not too sure what i put at the back um is that one oh, that doesn't look right let's have a look and one, okay, and the front are not the right ones. Yeah. <clears throat> so where are the right ones? Ah, there we go. So we'll chuck them on, and then we'll make them bigger. There we go. And then we want to put them bits there in black. So I've got like a rough idea how, what colour I would have it, so... Um... Why is that right in the... Bigger? Is it me or is that right in Bigger? That right in is bigger, even though it's the same tyre. 
Okay, so I went back in and what I pretty much done guys was put the um, ghost stretch tires on so it doesn't have any writing on the, on the tire at all because I found out with the BMW even though they're the same tire that I was using um, with the writing obviously of uh, uh, speed hunters down it the front would double the size so I thought well, screw it I'm just going to take it off um, and just put normal tires on so obviously we're in the paint garage now guys um, I've put it into a satin um, grey and I'm just going to put um, the top in black um, but I want one that sort of stands out that stands out only a little bit uh, okay, that one stands out a lot more for what I want, so that's that should be perfect, I think. Mm. So that's just too dark for what I want. So yeah, I'll say that one. Mm, I'm quite happy with that BMW actually. Very happy. Um, so yeah, uh, we're just going to take this out for a drive. And see what it sounds like. Um, see how it performs. Um, see, see what it's like. Because um, obviously I know there's a lot of people out there who like BMWs and especially this model or pretty much the M3 family. So I want to see if it performs how I, f how I know BMW M3 perform. So I want to see how it feels, how it drives. That sounds really nice for a BMW. <laughs> okay, the backfire on that sounds amazing. Um, so yeah, um, okay, so it can take corners really well for what you would really expect a BMW M3 to really do. Because obviously, BMW M3s are really good to handling cars, even in real, you know, in real life they are. Um, and obviously people use them for drifting as well and obviously it drifts them really well as well so this is literally a perfect one two combo if you want like a car that's good for like track racing or drifting this car is pretty much you know best best of both worlds if people like bmws um and if they like enjoy using bmws for obviously drifting this will obviously be one of the perfect cars that obviously have so yeah, I'm actually really quite proud of this car, actually. I actually quite like it. And, motherfucker, hit my beamer. Anyway. <laughs> um, but no, guys, um, what I, I would actually rate this. I rate this car. It's actually really good. But no, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Please like the video if you enjoyed it. And subscribe if you're new. The Lewis is out. I'll catch you on the next video, guys. Bye-bye.